let z is a graph uh, is an undirected simple graph in which each edge has a distinct weight okay and e is a particular edge of g which of the following statement about the minimum spanning tree of g is are true the first statement if e is the lightest edge of some cycle if e is the lightest edge of some cycle then every mst of g includes e and the second statement if e is the heaviest edge of some cycle in g then every mst of g excludes e uh, what does it mean let me take a scenario the first statement says that if e is the lightest edge in some cycle this edge is not lightest among all the edges but it is the lightest edge in one of the cycle okay so if this is the case suppose this 1 2 3 this is 15 this is 20 this is 24 and this is 26 yeah this is the example suppose so <coughs> suppose if you draw the spanning tree of the corresponding graph then what you will get uh, you will get like this a a to b is 1 a to c is 2 okay now you will not select this edge and after this a to e is 15 and then after then after the remaining possibilities you select c to f as 24 now look at this if you look at this cycle in this cycle there are three edges one is weight 20 one is 24 one is 26 and 20 is the smallest weight edge and now if you read the statement the statement clearly says that if e is the lightest edge in some cycle in g then every minimum spanning tree of g includes e which is clearly wrong statement it is not necessary that uh, that edge will be included in every minimum spanning tree okay even it is not possible uh, every time that you will select that edge because if that edge is forming a cycle then you will not select that edge okay and and there is a, the the statement is basically correct because uh, it is always said that uh, when we draw the when when we find the spanning uh, minimum cost spanning tree then we don't always select the smallest weight edge we select the smallest but we also ensure that the edge that you are picking should not form any cycle and if it is forming any cycle then you just throw out and you select the next weight it might be of the uh it, it, you select the next edge which uh, which is having more weight than the earlier one okay so uh, by saying the statement that if the edge is having the smallest in some cycle then you will select in every edge which is clearly wrong and the the example the counter example is the previously that we have shown okay and the second statement if e is the heaviest edge of some cycle in g then every mst of g excludes e actually this is a true statement and the reason is uh, the reason is comes uh, the reason comes because of the definition of the spanning tree suppose if there is a cycle okay if there is a cycle you can look at any of the cycle you can look at any of the cycle uh, according to the property of the minimum spanning tree we always look for the smallest edge the, the edge which is having the least weight and if there is an edge which is having more weight than the earlier one then you will not select the weight you will not select the edge which is having the more weight okay so naturally this statement is true okay this statement is true but the first statement is not true and the example is this okay you can just note down this counter example and this is the cycle that i'm showing to you okay and you will not find that edge e to c is available in any of the spanning tree okay you can just try this so here the answer will be uh the b the second only okay the second only is the correct one rest of them is false okay